Hi friends, it's Suzanne here from sunstampin.com, a Canadian Stampin' Up! demonstrator. Today's card features the Smitten Mittens stamp set as well as the Snowflake Sentiments and the Stampin' Blends, the new alcohol markers from Stampin' Up! So I'm stamping in Memento Tuxedo Black Ink, which is the recommended ink for the Stampin' Blend alcohol markers. Do be cautious to let that dry for a minute or two. Put it aside. Okay, so I'm starting off with my color lifter. This is a large uh, image and I am trying to make the blending. I find that the blending with these markers, it happens very nicely when they're juicy. So um, when the paper is dry, so it's going to suck some of that juice out. So sometimes if you start off with the color lifter in a large surface, you might um, find that it blends a little bit easier. Anyway, I also wanted the very top top to be pretty light, as you can see by the example on the left. So I'm also putting in a dark gray marker with the dark Razzleberry uh, marker right here at the cuff to create a darker, a very dark shade. So I managed to get a, four shades with these two markers. Well, yeah, four or five shades really. So, um, which is kind of cool. So the uh, Stampin' Blends, uh, the markers are $6 a piece. You can get the light and dark in a combo pack for 12. There tw there's 26 colors plus the lifter at $162. And at that point, if you're going to get them all, you might as well um, opt in for the best deal, which is basically choosing $165 worth of product for $135 with free shipping and a 20% ongoing discount. You know where I'm going with this? The best deal. Join as a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. I'd love to have you on my team. I'll put the link in the description bar below. And if you're at all considering picking up these markers, the whole kit and caboodle, you might want to check that out. Okay, enough of the uh, business talk. This is Versamark Inc. Um, I used the Embossing Buddy, but it didn't uh, pick it up. And um, I used the Embossing Buddy after the Wink of Stella. I did the, and for whatever reason, it's lost in my video here. Um, heating from behind is a personal preference. That is white embossing powder that I have going on there. And that's the reason why I wanted those cuffs to be really, really dark. Okay, so this is the Winter Wonder Emboss Folder. Um, in other words, the big snowflake. Didn't know, don't know why they didn't call it the big snowflake. I mean, really, it's pretty obvious. Um, and then I'm going to die cut the mittens with the many mittens die cut or um, thinlet dies, pardon me. And um, I, of course, did that twice. And I'm thinking uh, these are going to be my Christmas cards for my niece and nephew. So um, that hence the reason for the two different colorways, the rich Razzleberry, and now we're working with the Bermuda Bay. And then fast fuse on one of the mittens and dimensionals on the second mitten right over top of that um, big snowflake. <laughs> this was a lot of fun making these cards. I had a lot of fun with the Stampin' Up! Um, blends and I hope to be bringing you a couple more videos in the future, just giving you sort of a heads up on how to do a couple of few fun techniques. Anyway, thanks so much for joining me and I'll catch you tomorrow. Bye. Hey, thanks for sticking around to the end of the video. On screen are two more videos for inspiration. Click on the maple leaf to visit my website or click on me to subscribe to my channel. Thanks again for watching.